Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Arielle and today I have a wedding dress try on from JJ's house. JJ's house reached out to me after I posted my engagement video and said, would you like to do a review for us? I went on their website, I looked at everything. I read so many reviews and I said, yes, I would. I absolutely would. My review is on wedding dresses, but they do have a dress for every single occasion or special and moment. They also have jewelry and accessories. Trials. On the main this page, I went to Broad. And then under bride, I went to plus size. Right now, today, there are 214 dresses in the plus size category. And these dresses are different cuts, different colors, different materials, and you can get them custom. My dresses were custom. So to walk you through that process, um, I did measurements, bust, waist, hips, um, from the collarbone to the floor, something in the back, Everything they asked for, I just did it, measured it out, sent it over, and they made the dress. You can also do standard, like number size, so one, I mean two, four, six, eight, 20, 24, 26, like that. Um, but I do think custom is better because you're sure that it's gonna fit your body. Custom does cost extra, but it's worth it. I'm telling you it's worth it. When you see the price of the dress, the extra for the custom is worth it. There were many reasons why I said yes, but I'm gonna give you my top three. First of all, I'm gonna be a 2024 bride and as exciting as it is, it's also kind of nerve wracking. Um, I knew there was there was a lot of things I didn't wanna do um, that other people would say are traditional. One of the things I never, I knew I didn't wanna be in a wedding dress store trying dresses on. So being able to try dresses at home, in the comfort of my own home, private with me and you, yeah, and something nobody ever talks about is how hot it can be. So I'm in the comfort of my own home and the air conditioning of my own home. Number two is the customer service. I was a little bit hesitant in the beginning, I'm not gonna lie, because I am plus size. And I'm like, are these dresses gonna fit? Like you say you plus size, but are you really plus size? Like, do you really get it? And they do get it. They were very kind. They were patient with me. And that is something that I read in many reviews that they will bend over backwards for you and make you feel like a priority. Number three is the price. Even with the upcharge on custom, the price is right. And honestly, you wear these dresses most of the time once in like, so to spend a whole bunch of money on it, especially for me, it doesn't make a lot of sense. And I know this video is going to help other people who don't want to spend a whole lot of money, but they want quality for a special day. So let's get straight into the dresses. The first dress is an Alon V-neck court train lace tool. If I could only use one word to describe this dress, it would be dreamy. She is so flowy, so free. Definitely the lightest of all the dresses I'm showing today as far as weight. From top to bottom, there's details. Every time you move, you see a new detail. Something new just pops up. Now, it feels really nice on me. I appreciated the support that I had in the chest area and the shoulders. I personally could wear this dress without a bra and it would still look put together and like everything is is up where it's supposed to be this is a simple dress but the details really make it pop this reminds me of something that would be like good for a spring outside nature wedding dress number two is a ball gown princess sweetheart sweep train lace tool now one word to describe number two is grande she is the biggest the heaviest, the most va va voom. This dress is massive, definitely a ball gown. I decided to get this because on the model, I love the sweetheart neckline and I loved how the sleeves just rested gracefully on her arms. My sleeves were giving me a bit of a time. So I tried wearing them just down like the model and then I tried putting them up like normal and I really didn't like either way so I personally would just cut those off and just wear the dress as is. Now, the chest area was a little big for me, but luckily they did include the invisible straps. So that was an option. This dress is beautiful. The lace is delicate. The I don't know exactly what the wording is for what's under the dress to make it like so poofy and big, but this dress is just stunning. Like everything about it is beautiful. Besides the chest being big, 10 out of 10 if you like the ballroom look. Dress number three is a ball gown princess off the shoulder chapel train lace tool. I fell in love with this dress first and it was the first one I picked to review. 
mainly because it's off the shoulder, but I also really like the detail on the lace. Now, if I could only choose one word to describe this dress, it's princess. 100% feel like a Disney princess in my big white dress. Okay, there is a there's a tool skirt in the dress that gives it the puffy, big, flared look. And there's like three layers in the dress altogether, but I don't know what they're called. It's my first time trying on wedding dresses, so bear with me. The top of the dress, I was a little worried that the sleeves wouldn't fit, but surprisingly, they were a bit too big. So that works. Um, the chest fit perfectly. And um, I don't even feel like mine was that tight and I didn't have to keep pulling on my chest area at all. And I do have my bra on. I just pushed the straps to the side so you can't see them, but I do have support. Um, from top to bottom, this dress is perfection. Great quality. I love the way it looks. I love the way it feels. Now on to dress number four. I definitely saved the best for last. Dress number four is my favorite. She is a ball gown princess off the shoulder court train. When I was choosing the dresses I wanted to do the review on, I did not have a set style in mind. I just chose dresses that caught my eye. So I'm not sticking with a theme here. They do, they may seem like they're everywhere. This specific dress, it caught my eye just because of how simple it was. So if I could use one word only to describe it, it would be captivating. You can see there's not a lot going on. Most of the detail on this dress is at the bottom and on the train. Even with all the simplicity though, you can't help but to look at this. I believe this was the last dress that I picked and I didn't expect it to be so lightweight. For some reason, it look, it looks a lot heavier than it is. This is something you could wear doing anything and totally forget that you have a wedding dress on because it feels so light and airy. This one was a little bigger on me, especially in the chest area. It does have a lace up back. So, you know, you could pull it as tight as you need to, but still, I needed some type of support. Now, I do have my bra on, but I also put my bra straps in the dress. So, one thing I didn't take into account just because I did not know, is how much work happens under the dress for the top of it to, to work. Um, overall, this dress is beautiful. It really speaks to my personality, calm, but you look at it and you just want to know more. I don't feel like it's a lot going on. This also could be a nice dress for like a spring wedding. I like the off the shoulder sleeves. They were a bit big. Um, Unlike the other dress, I would not want to cut those off. I really like these more than the other. I feel like they're much more graceful. The movement, the airiness, the freeness of this dress makes it my favorite. Definitely the lightest of all four, and it feels the best quality-wise. She is my number one. I'm trying to think if I said everything. Yeah, the chest area is bigger. Under the chest, there is a band that lays nicely if you do not have a heavy chest. Since I do have a heavy chest, the band gets lost and then it gets twisted up and it just doesn't really want to cooperate. But again, that is an issue that proper undergarments should be able to fix. All in all, everything about this dress, I love it. Um, it's just me. Feels good, looks good, amazing quality. Those were the dresses I chose from JJ's House and I am so happy to share them with you and get my honest opinion. JJ's House is a real company. Real reviews. It is legit. I know this video is going to help somebody find their dress for their special occasion. I want to say thank you to JJ's House for making this possible. I will link all the dresses in the description. Check JJ's House out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.